Tips from the Ultimate Training Manual in Becoming Spider-Man and Spider-Woman Lesson 1, The Spider Bite So a radioactive spider sinks its fangs into you, here's what you have to do. Immediately catch the little bugger so he can't get away, or just squish him. Next, wash your infected hand off and apply Neosporin to clean the wound. Now here's where it gets real interesting. Find a safe spot to crash and sleep because the next few hours are going to be a physical tornado on your body. You'll notice when you awake that you'll be super limber and agile. As well as noticing muscular physical changes in your body's aesthetic. Lesson 2, Costume Design There are tons of different Spidey suit variations. Peter Parker's first costume wasn't designed with fighting in mind, which explains the less than stealthy choices of red and blue. Your new spider powers will require a flexible range of motion, so spandex works best. Avoid unnecessary accessories. Capes and jackets give villains something to grab and also weigh you down. It's smart to cover your body from head to toe, so your enemies won't be able to notice traits about you when you're in your civilian clothing. Your suit should be practical, stylish, and comfortable. Chances are you'll be wearing it under your street clothes, so it'll need to be lightweight and not too thick, but also not too thin, especially when you're crime fighting in winter months. With these tips, you'll create your Spidey suit concepts in no time. Good luck. Lesson 3, Web Shooters. Every spider needs its web. Without his trusty web shooter, Spidey will be nothing but an incredibly strong, agile, sharp-witted guy in tights. But a webless Spider-Man will be reduced to handcuffing criminals, and that's not a great look for someone who goes around claiming to be a Spider-Man. So unless you can spin webs organically, you'll need to make sure the polymer of fluid is extremely strong to hold your weight when swinging dozens of stories over the street. Pound for pound, Spidey's webs are three times the tensile strength of galvanized steel. Activated by a palm trigger, the fluid should expand from small capsules stored in mechanical bracelets that will be worn around your wrists. Keeping spare cartridges is important if you run out of webbing mid-swing or mid-fight. Also, make sure the fluid evaporates after an hour. You don't want to be seen as a menace to window washers, after all. With these tips, you'll be well on your way to spinning webs of your own around town. Lesson 4, Spider Agility. Spider-Man does whatever a spider can, including having the agility and evasion of a spider. You'll notice after acquiring your abilities that your reflexes are heightened to a sensational degree. You can naturally pull off quick dodges, jumps, and flips unlike never before. It's important to utilize these new reflexes for your heroics. Flips and handsprings make for stylish and effective ways to dodge incoming attacks as well as creating distance from your opponents. Having great control over the mechanics of your body is very important as an active superhero and having a spandex costume will help aid in your aerodynamics and range of motion to effectively use your new acrobatic agility with no resistance. Practicing your new skills will help refine your arsenal and make you a better Spider-Man or woman. So get the practicing and stay tuned for more lessons. Lesson 5, Spider-Sense. Spider-Sense is going crazy. Spider-Man is capable of amazing skills, but no power has saved his skin more often than his trusty spider sense. This tingling sensation you'll feel in the back of your head is an alert to incoming danger. You'll notice time may seem to slow down a bit and allow your spider reflexes to get out of dodge or to focus your attention towards an incoming problem. Truth be told, you could be blindfolded and still be able to navigate your surroundings due to your spider sense. When utilized correctly, it'll save your butt more often than not. To refine your sense, practice blindfolding yourself and jump around a location full of obstacles. This will help your reflexes and make you a better prepared crime fighter.